In this tutorial, we will show you how to handle blank cells in Excel. Let us suppose we have to write no in every blank cell under the heading insurance. Instead of typing it manually, we can select all the blank cells. First, highlight the targeted column and then go to the Find and Select button in the editing group. From the drop down menu, select the Go to Special option. When the new box appears, click on Blanks and then press the OK button. All the blank cells in the selected range will be highlighted. Type No and press Control and Enter. All the blank cells will have No written in them. Dealing with blank cells is different if you are taking out an average of something. Consider there was an employee who made sales on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. If we take out the average, it will come out to be 8.33. If we put it this way that the rest of the days he was not productive and did not make a sale, and we enter zero, then the average changes. In the average function, the blank cells are not considered zero unless you put a zero in there. Blank cells have different implications in different scenarios, so you should know them when making calculations.